Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to fix the microphones not working on your iPad Pro. So let's diagnose together, you do this by opening up the Voice Memos app, and I simply start recording and just speak for, you know, a couple of seconds. Then tap on Done, and let's take a look at what we're looking for. So we're going to start the recording, and I'm going to play it. So if you listen to that recording, you can hear me nice and clear. Maybe when I'm moving my fingers, I may be like touching the microphone, that may make a bit of noise, but for the most part, everything sounds okay. Now, if your microphones are not working, what you're looking for is first of all, you just hear this like this crackling sound nonstop 24 seven. Maybe it sounds like you are underwater 24 seven. And uh, if that's the case, the microphone just doesn't sound good, then you are entitled to a free replacement by Apple. How easy is that? So before we get the replacement, do keep in mind that if you have Bluetooth headphones plugged in, it's gonna be using the microphone from the Bluetooth headphones, which is gonna sound garbage. So if uh, just quickly, if you have Bluetooth headphones in, just take them out, then test, because if the Bluetooth headphones mic is sounding like garbage, that's just Bluetooth for you, okay? If the iPad Pro's mic sounds like garbage, then let's get the replacement. So you do this by opening up the App Store, and you're gonna search up for Apple, so Apple space support, okay? Search this one up, tap on it and download the Apple support app. And then from here, you're gonna open it up. You're gonna see your iPad Pro, select it, and you're just going to see here, uh, device performance, okay? You're gonna tap into this one, and then you're gonna see all of these issues. Just tap on, tell us what's happening. You're gonna search, uh, type in even, microphone is not working. Okay, tap on next. It's gonna say finding your best options, which product you need help with. You're gonna find your iPad Pro. So let's just find it. For some reason, I selected the iPad Pro, I hadn't selected it. Uh, I may be blind, I actually can't see it. I'm just going to select a general help iPhone. It's gonna say finding your best options. And all you want to do is go to the message section. So it really doesn't matter what you filled out, but you just want to tap on message, it'll bring you to the iMessage app and you'll be talking with an Apple employee. Just talk to them, sell the issue, they'll give you a free repair if the iPad Pro is less than a year old. If the iPad Pro is over a year old, they're gonna try and charge you money. So uh, you can get the repair for free still. All you need to do is uh, as long as you bought the iPad Pro from Apple directly, you have six years of warranty, okay? Six years. So if they're like, oh, we're gonna charge you or we're gonna give you a quote on the price, when they say that, you're gonna say, I would like to do the repair through consumer law. They'll like try and like make it hard to get through. As long as you have the original proof of purchase, you're good to go. If you bought your iPad Pro from another website, you want to contact that other website, not Apple, and ask for a warranty claim that way via consumer law. Because how the law works, okay, is you have six years of warranty from the delivery date of your iPad Pro. But the warranty only applies to where you bought the iPad Pro from, okay? So if you bought it from Apple, you contact Apple for the, uh, for the consumer law repair. If you bought the iPad Pro from another store like John Lewis, you contact John Lewis for the repair. If you bought through eBay, you're screwed, but anywhere else uh, that isn't eBay, uh, you'll be good to go and they'll give you that consumer law uh, repair completely free of charge. Otherwise, they will charge money, could be 50 quid, could be a couple hundred dollars. It really just depends. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.